Hey guys, welcome back, and today we have another review of the Mega Bloks Halo Universe sets. This one is set number 97039. It is 8 and up. It is the UNSC Scorpion. $20 at Walmart. I got a coupon, so I got it for 15 but it is normally 20 so Let me show you the box. It's fairly big compared to the last one, the Warthog. It has the Mega Bloks Halo Universe logo on it, the set information, the usual warning stuff, then the same Spartan, and still the Metal Series. Down the top you got the different languages and then the collectible figure in this one is a uh, Spartan with two Magnums. Then on the side just has the Scorpion and it actually has a, this one has a power function in it so it's pretty cool. There's a diorama of all the Series 1 sets. Then shows all the functions and the power function and the battlescapes. Then once again all the collectible figures. That EVA one looks pretty nice. So. Once again, the manual is, this one's a little bit longer, like three steps just because there's three pieces, but that's pretty much the basis of it right there in that picture. So first, the exclusive figure you get in this set is the uh, Spartan with dual magnums. Very nice. Once again, it says Mega Bloks on the bottom. Very, but very nice. Very nicely sculpted. He's kind of in a cool pose there, holding both of his magnums. So that's very, very nice. Put him off to the side. Next up, you get another Spartan, this time with an assault rifle, kind of aiming with it and shooting some guys. Pretty basic, nothing really new with it. Then that, they all say Mega Bloks on the bottom. Next, you get an Elite with a sniper rifle, and or actually a beam rifle, which is very very nice. Nice purple, very good detailing. Next is one I found a little bit odd. It's a Grunt. But he's holding a plasma rifle. And usually you don't see grunts holding these. They use plasma pistols. But whatever, you know, not that too big of a flaw. Still looks pretty cool. So he's kind of aiming down with it and shooting guys. He's a purple grunt. So that's very nice. Then the battle skate part you get. You get three of these. And they all look very nice. Now to show you what I was talking about when you can connect them. I have my warthog battle skate right here. With the studs already in place. You just do this. You push them in, and you can see that you have an even bigger battlescape to put guys on. So I'll leave that right there. Next is a scorpion, which again is all metal. Very, very nice. Nothing uh, nothing bad about it. And the treads actually move too. They actually put very good detailing into this. Now the one minifigure that the tank comes with is the tank driver. It's just a Spartan in the driving position. Let's put him back in there. This thing, I don't get how it would close, because it his head is blocking the way. But that's not that big of a deal. My camera will stay in focus. Then these are all printed decals. You got the Scorpion, the UNSC, the UNSC emblem, then the same stuff on this side. Now the power function I was telling you about is the cannon, which rotates, actually fires by pressing this button right here. It actually fires pretty, pretty nice actually fires the front of the cannon, but you know, it's still cool that it can do that. So it's very nice. Then it just connects into the tank's cannon, like this such. So my camera will focus. Connects like this. Whoops, sorry guys, my camera will not focus today. You just do this, and it connects like that. And it does rotate 360 degrees. And the button I was talking about is right here, you just push this and it fires. And you can rotate it with the button too, and fire it, or you can just do it from the front. The turret right here, it's made of some kind of rubbery thing, so it does not fire anything. Same with these two antennas on the top, they're just antennas. But it the, the, the cool thing is it looks like you build this, it has the studs, but you don't do any assembly, they're all pre-assembled for you, which is very, very nice. But... It is a pretty nice set, like I said, $20 at Walmart. Very, very, it's worth the money, I like it a lot. They are, these new sets are very interesting, kind of like the um, mystery packs, you collect them and try and get more. So it is a very interesting concept, I like them a lot, I'll, I'll be picking up more in the future. But tell me what you guys think in the comment section below, tell me if you like them, if you think it's a waste of money or if it's a good idea. Or if they can expand on it and do something. Whatever you feel like saying, just say it in the comments below. But anyways guys, thank you for watching. Please rate, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you next time.